to the garden. Here you go, Mr. Longface. Pomegranate tea and apple slices. Oh, thank you, Miss Shortcake. You're very welcome. And thank you for watching the cafe for me. My pleasure. And how is your garden growing? Oh, I'm hoping my flowers will be at their best in time for the flower festival. Come on, Pupcake. <laughs> Ah, oh, yes. The Flower Festival. The event of the year. Oh, hi, Johnny. How are you doing? How are you doing? Hi, everyone. Hi, Berry Can Bloom. Well, your roses look very lovely this year. <laughs> As usual. You just might win again, as usual. Thank you, Lemon Meringue. Strawberry Shortcake. Uh, here, Strawberry. Your flowers might want some water uh, before the day gets any hotter. Why, thank you. Those are beautiful, Lemon. I think that this year your flowers are going to be the ones to beat. Oh, no. You can't mean my violets stand a chance against your award-winning roses. Oh, I'm telling no lies. You could win the first prize. You're so kind to say so. <sighs> first prize. <laughs> and now, to the individual who has toiled from sunrise to sunset, growing the most perfect flowers, I award first prize to... Lemon Meringue! <laughs> It's getting late. Are you coming in? We were worried about you. You've been out here for hours. I'll be right there. Soon as I tuck them in for the night. Good night. See you in the morning. <laughs> Weird. We're so sorry, Lemon. My poor Violets. What could have happened? It's certainly a mystery. We'll find out how it happened. But who would do such a thing? Who? You think someone took your Violets? A flower thief. <laughs> oh, good morning, Miss Meringue. You're here early today. So are you. Good morning, Mr. Green. How are you? Hmm. Lemon? Oh, my. Oh, me. Is that sadness I see? I... Uh, uh... Lemon's had a misfortune, Mr. Bloom. One of her violets went missing. Oh, no. But... but how? We don't know. Oh, that's so sad for you. Now I feel bad, too. I'm sure you do. Come on, Lemon. I'll make you a pancake breakfast and wake me up fruit juice surprise at the cafe. <laughs> Lemon, you don't really think that nice Mr. Bloom would do a thing like that, do you? Of course not, but... Uh, well... Didn't you see? See what? His guardian is right next to mine. That's true. Well? It's also true that we've known Barrican Bloom a long time. Lemon, you've got to be careful of accusing people. You could really hurt someone's feelings. Uh, I'd never want that to happen. <sighs> You're right, Strawberry. Barrican Bloom would never do a thing like that. This is Miss Meringue. M m m more of my violets are missing! Stolen! Oh, goodness me. I didn't see. I was here the whole time, but I... I witnessed no crime. Well, we're actually not really sure there's been a crime. If Barrican Bloom didn't see anything, there must be another explanation. <laughs> Point, though, Strawberry. No one else was around all 
birthday except Barry Kim Bloom. And he told me I'm his biggest competition. Maybe he's only complimenting you. He is nice that way. Why do you think he would steal your violets anyway? Because his roses win the flower show every year, and he wants to make sure he wins this year, too. <laughs> oh, you? You come back here, you little troublemaker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lemon, I'm so sorry about your violets. I know how much you care about them, and how awful it feels to lose something so special. Thanks, Strawberry. But it would feel pretty bad if someone accused you of stealing when you didn't. I know, but why is he there all the time when no one else is? Maybe... He's there all the time working on his roses, because he cares about them so much. Just like you care about your violets. <sighs> That's true. Just don't make up your mind about what happened until we can figure it out for sure, okay? Okay, Strawberry. I'll try. And in the meantime, hope that whatever happened to your flowers doesn't happen again. <laughs> Mine are gone! Mine are gone, too! <gasps> How could it? Who did this? Just like lemons! Everyone has flowers missing! Not everyone! Barrick and Bloom, did you lose any? Thank goodness all my roses are here. I'm so sorry for your flowers, my dear. Who else could it be? It's gotta be him. Oh, it's like Lemon said. This is serious, Strawberry. Very serious. Well... <laughs> my garden is like yours. It's just as I feared. My very best roses. They... <laughs> they disappeared. <laughs> oh. Oh, Barrick and Bloom. I'm so, so, so sorry. You don't know how sorry. What will we do? Flower Festival is two days away. We're going to get to the bottom of this, Princess. Okay, girls. What did everyone find? Well, with all the flowers missing, whoever carried them off... If someone carried them off. Okay. If someone carried them off, they are either really big or there is a lot of them. But we didn't find any tracks. Yeah. No tracks except ours. No, that's spooky. Uh, maybe the thief flew in. Could be. At this point, anything's possible. Where were you on the night when this terrible tragedy occurred? <laughs> Me too. Oh, asleep, huh? That seems mighty suspicious. Uh, Lemon? They always sleep at night. Oh. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Violet Petal Salad, huh? Why, hello there, Miss Meringue. Uh, yes, my favorite. My precious violets. Lunch! Mr. Longface, how could you? Oh, but they're not your violets. <laughs> I weeded and watered and worked for weeks growing my... They're not? Oh, no. I grew them myself. I'm afraid they're not fine enough to enter into the festival, uh, but good enough to eat. Huh. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mr. Longface. Strawberry, it's just... I can't get over this bad... Feeling I have from hurting Mr. Longface's feelings. And after.
after you warned me, too. I know. Sometimes it's hard not to jump to conclusions. I won't do it again. I want to get all the facts. That's what we're going to get. Yep. Ready for Catch a Thief Camp Out. This is gonna be so scary. I can't wait. to mention too nice. So let's, you know, check the pictures. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> There's a great one. <laughs> Ew, look at me. You, <laughs> look at me. Hey, Lemon, this shot of your violets came out great. Nice one, Strawberry. Thanks. Hey, everybody, come here. Look at this. What? What is that? I don't know. But whatever it was, from the angle of the photo, it was right over... there. Come on, Lemon. You want to check it out, don't you? Uh, uh-huh. Sure. Festival instead. Guys, I'm telling you, it's like something was under the ground. Things were going up and going down and sideways and forwards and shaking. It was like the end of the world. The end of the world? Not the end of the world. Close to the end of the world? No. The day before the end of the world, when it's getting into the part where all life as we know it ceases to hum. Huh? have something to do with each other.
cars are not being picked up. Yeah, they're being pulled down. <gasps> mystery. Okay, Strawberry, if you say so. Are sure first prize with somebody. <laughs> Just my luck, it's a gopher. Wait, it's cute and all, but what will we tell Princess Barrican? With this critter around, we won't have any more flower festivals. Or flowers, for that matter. I think I have an idea. <laughs> Lemon, you're the best. But I feel bad that you don't have any flowers to enter in the festival. <sighs> so do I. Can I help you with that, Mr. Blue? Hello, Lemon. Uh, thank you. Mr. Blue, I wanted to say I'm sorry about... Well, you see... I thought maybe you took my violets because you wanted to win. Oh, Lemon. In my heart. Oh, I knew you'd never do something like that, but somehow I let myself think it before I found out the truth. Will you forgive me? Of course, Lemon. You know, I do want to win. But what fun would it be if I was the only one in the contest? I heard how you gave up the flowers you loved best. By doing that, you saved mine and all of the rest. Thanks. And good luck. I hope you win. Thank you, Lemon. And second prize goes to... Barrican Bloom for his lovely roses. Second prize? He didn't win first prize? I can't believe it. I think his roses are the nicest. And now, the first prize for the most beautiful flowers in Berry Bitty City. The first 
prize goes to Lemon Meringue. Congratulations, Lemon. Congratulations, Lemon. Your violets really were first prize. But I didn't even enter a flower. Strawberry entered it for you. You're very welcome, Lemon. But it was Barry Can Bloom's ID. 